lovely people on my youtube channel i welcome you once again to be part of my youtube channel if today be your first time in here try to do me a favor subscribe to the youtube channel and don't forget to hit on the notification bell without much further ado let's get started today i'm i'm going to design um something like this that is supermarket banner okay supermarket banner um is is kind of uh, something that i thought you know that i should do something with it it's going to be very simple and all that but i'm going to show you i'm going to teach you very way that you will understand it's going to be something simple okay because all the time i just want my designs to be that simple for everybody who is coming up to be a so do you know what i'm going to create a new document which is going to be the work okay and the size i'm using is 11 inches by 5 inches and uh, i just want to maintain the resolution to be 300 and i'll press ok so here we go this is what i'm going to get okay now what i have to do is go to my rectangle tool pick it up and then draw start from this end to this place like that okay now the color in here is white uh, you can see fill color here okay whenever you draw okay whenever you pick the rectangle tool the color will show in here okay so you can go ahead and change the color to whatever you want so i will draw right here like this i love this color okay now if you want to see the code of this color what you have to do is go to the layers double click on this panel thumbnail box here okay layer thumbnail you click on that and this is the code for the color okay so right here you're done now i'm going to bring in my minerals food and all that in here like this i'm going to position it here okay others will position it right here some will position it right here but no i mean in a professional way because all of this is in one line you see it's all in one line okay all in one line so kind of position it in the middle like that okay very simple and very nice now i'm going to uh, do this one right supermarket okay so i'll go for my text tool no let's let's let me show you some kind of effect for uh, this color right here so i'm going to okay what the kind of effect i want to uh, i want to create for this ship right here the red ship in here if i don't rasterize it will not take effect so before that effect will apply on this ship i have to rasterize it so you right click on your you just click right um you right click on your on your on the ship and then in the layer and you rasterize it so you see that after you rasterize the thumbnail the layer thumbnail here will disappear that means you have rasterized the shape now the reason why we rasterize it as i said earlier if you don't rasterize the effect will not take place or the effect will not be applied on the ship right here so that is why we rasterize it so that the effect can easily be applied now i'll go to my filter tab 
right from filter tab i will click on filter gallery so right from uh, filter gallery i'll come to this point i'm using texture okay and now this texture is you see when you open it that's how it is so you just click on this arrow right here and it's gonna open um the one i'm using is this one okay i'm using the grain okay and we have um intensive intensity and contrast so how you want it you see is what is going to apply on the shape for you all right so um a little bit like that okay i mean the effect shouldn't be too much you know check this out it's very it's too much so this are the these are the bars you will use to increase the effect after that you press okay you can see it has taken rasterized okay so after we done that i'm going for my text my text and then make sure the text the color is white you see you will not see the color until you click on the text tool and after you click on the text tool type tool okay you can call it um, type tool or text tool so you just click and then you type supermarket i don't know if the super i don't know if i'm right with the spellings you can drop that in the comment section okay i don't know if if i'm i'm right i, I don't know um i'm changing it to you know in photoshop if you type something in caps in caps in small letters in lowercase and you want to change it you see this tt in here all caps so we just click on it to um to increase the size i mean to make it okay so right here i will go to um you see there's some um, design in here like that you can see it has some um it has a stroke all right it's have some stroke right here so i'm going to layer i'll go to layer and then click on this fx right here after clicking on the fx i'll go to um let me give the gradient because there are some gradients in there all right and um i'll click on the color right from there make sure you, I'll, i'm using the basis one okay so i'll click on this one all right after clicking on this one uh, I'll change the style to reflected, okay? And uh, I'm going to create, okay? So you click on this one. If you want to click after you, if you want to create another bar, you just click on this one click okay you click on this one this one and then you click so it's that simple right okay so um, okay okay let me take it like that all right now I'm going to create the layer, the stroke. Okay, so let's create stroke. You just click on the, make sure you click on the market and you click on the FX. Right from the FX, you click on the stroke, and then you come. The stroke is in gradient. You say type, fill type is in gradient. So I'll make it color, and this one I'll change it to white. Okay, 
no this color i'll change you to this color right here okay so right from there i'm going to decrease the size a little bit and uh, i'm going to you know you you're going to see some classes in here classes you see plus 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 you can click on the plus and the layers will create another one for you which is this one and uh, i'm going to give that one white and increase the size like that okay so here we go can increase this one to a little bit like that and this is what is actually going to give you you understand so we are done for this one and uh, i'm going to i'm going to use some uh, shape right here costume shape i don't know you know some 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 designs i see this right there and i don't actually know the reason why we they place this kind of uh, symbol are there i don't know if it's for registration uh i can't tell so if you really know the reason why sometimes some designs they place this in there let me know okay let me know i mean we are all <laughs> learning okay we are all learning so i'll place this one right there and the market the owner says they they will do uh, they will do delivery so i just use this bike right here like that in here so let me place it right here okay and then bring in the number the number two there okay the font i'm using is um the name of the font is called montserrat okay it's a Montserrat font so this one is Montserrat and this one this one is called at the name is kind of at Zilut at Zilut so I'll make sure I leave the link in the description below so that you will downloaded it yourself so this is something it's simple but it's very nice right so this is what i'm actually recommending to each and everybody just try to uh, do something like this i mean if you if somebody comes to you and asks you to do this simple for them i mean they will love it it's 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 it talks about a little colors in there and all that because the food is kind of colors all right so you can also use this colors right here to you know uh design anything of your choice okay so let me draw this one right here and then change the color to kind of brighter ash okay ash this is the this is the code you can check that out and um, let me use let me create a layer and make this one white okay go for my brush tool you know in brush tool you can automatically press on your keyboard once you press b letter b on your keyboard it will turn to blue to to automatically select the brush tool okay so isn't this beautiful i mean 
let me hear your comments how do you see this tutorial okay so thank you very much and have a lovely day please do me a favor subscribe to the channel and um, yeah share share try to share you know try to share for me share to your loved ones share to your parties share to the share to you know some of your friends are talking about telling me i do suffer for this design so sometimes i don't know what to do and all that you know just share to them share to them share to them let them learn something and also subscribe i'm telling you one day they'll come back and say give you the credit you know they will give you the credit though i will be the one designing but you will be the one to take the credit because why because you share for them to subscribe to learn it so do me a favor subscribe and be part of this my awesome family see you in my next video bye